But I'm going to say in this situation, don't fight nobody ugly and don't fight no one you beating in real life. Last summer was a you guys welcome back to my channel i know it's been like a couple of weeks since i've posted but i'm back i'm back i've been extremely busy because i'm about to launch my new hoodies and i have to create all the samples and stuff and it's not easy because i have to stitch the designs find the designs like make them on the computer then digitize them then take them to an embroiderer it's a lot of work so that's what i've been doing in the past couple of weeks also i had moved and that wasn't an easy process. So right now I am in the vehicle. We are going to try a new drink from Dunkin' Donuts. I think it's a uh, ice blueberry matcha latte. Oh my God, with extra ice or something like that. I hate matcha, matcha tastes like dirt to me, but if you guys don't already know, every day I go to Starbucks and try new drinks, but if you guys have watched on my TikTok, I've been having some unfortunate events at Starbucks. So we're going to Dunkin'. Today I say that I have to get a, um, a little tripod for my car and I never do. Here's the drink. Can y'all see that? Here's the drink. Um, it's a small ice matcha latte, vanilla, um, blueberry shots, and liquid cane sugar. I use almond milk because I don't want to unbalance my pH. What? The what? No, sir. No, sir. If you ever want a low quality drink, please go to Dunkin'. Like, Dunkin' does not have quality drinks. But don't mind my chewing. That snack and bacon is dumb good. It goes crazy. And if you wrap it around a hash brown and put ketchup on it, bro, thank me later. Get the snack and bacon if you go to Dunkin', though. But the drinks, skip that. Skip that step. So today's agenda includes I need to do my eyebrows like this is nasty i haven't done them in two months since i moved so my eyebrows need to be done i need to do my hair over so yeah that's where we're at today play um up all night by drake and Nicki minaj here's up all night featuring Nicki minaj by drake on apple music the fact that I'm the youngest nigga doing it Cap on brim, bend, dance, sell every time She ain't trying to Mixtape, that was just a keepsake Want the president, the Louis presidential briefcase Never like, like no I'm, I'm a bad bitch I ain't never been a mixed beat On a diet, but I'm doing donuts in a six speed But I collect a hundred thou at the venue And pop bottles with my team Young money to the government Nobody can tell me Let me roll the window up for this part Nobody could tell. Oh, it's hot. Woo! I mean, that Up All Night is not the best Nicki verse ever. 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 It beats Monster, bro. Nobody could tell me different. Did you just hear that? She said on a diet, but I'm doing donuts in the six speed. What are you talking about, Nicki? Speak to them. Let me stop before I crash my car. Let me open back up the window. Hold y'all look a little homeless. But yes, yeah, so I'm in my vlog with this little mini story time. Um, I'm sitting outside Tater Tot School. He finna get out, so I only got like 10 minutes to tell this story. So if you guys are not already following me on TikTok, if you guys are not already following me on TikTok, please go do so because the first half to this story is on there. I'm just gonna like briefly describe describe. I'm just gonna briefly talk about what happened in the end 
So basically, I described on my TikTok, which is listed below in the description and on the bottom of the screen. This girl tried to fight me over her baby daddy. A man that I was not in a relationship with, but she believed in her heart that we were together. So, you know, if if that's how she gets to sleep at night, do your thing. Um, She wasn't a bitter baby mom. She was like, mm, spiteful baby mom. Now, if you watch my TikToks, you know, this is the same girl that hit me up on my Instagram and said she wanted to fight and sent me her personal address. She sent me without provocation. It's not like I said, yeah, I'm about to pull up on you. Sis really just went out of her way, sent me her home address where her and her son live, which literally concerned me. I didn't even care at the fact that she said she wanted to fight. Why are you sending out the address that your mom and your son live at? Which is crazy to me, but you know what I mean? it's I'm not an ACS worker, so who am I, you know? Did troll her back, and I did make it seem like I was on my way. I was never on my way. I was in my bed. If it's one thing my mom taught me is to never fight no one that you're doing better than or that you look better than. You don't benefit from that fight. These people have nothing to lose. So it got to the point where all of her efforts to try to get me upset were not working. So she started creating fake pages like on Instagram, fake phone numbers. Um, when I say phone numbers, I mean a plethora of them, like multiple numbers a day. She got her whole, she recruited her whole family to help her because I was getting like six, seven texts from different numbers back to back. So. She had a whole team of people contacting me. It wasn't working for her. So then she started writing herself from these fake pages and saying that it was me threatening her kid, which is really gross in retrospect. If you think about it, you made a fake page and threatened your own kid. Yeah, whatever. When all of that didn't work, her last option was to try to get a restraining order against me. Yeah, so she tried to get a restraining order. I, I read the police report, and, like, when I say, like, I've been stalked by, like, another woman, a woman, another girl, person, whatever. I've been stalked by people before, but the 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 length that she went to stalk me, I believe she should be definitely applied for, like, a homeland security job. She would have definitely found Osama bin Laden if they gave her an opportunity. She was very detailed in how she, um... And how she stalked me in that police report. Um, I was even I was even like taken back because I'm like, dang, how you know which time I I clicked my Instagram app? Like when I I kid you not, the report was like 8:42 a.m. Takia um, posts a story. 8 8:43 Takia likes three posts. 11:43. Takia posts in her story and describes everything I post. All of the things she did did not work. Her last resort was to go file a police report that did not even go through. And because it didn't go through with me, then she filed one against her child's father saying that um, she felt unsafe or something like that. But then after the police report, like she got her child's father arrested and everything. So while I'm editing, I forgot to say in this part that she did get her child. Oh, oh my God, God I have a double jump. She did get her child's father jumped and then arrested after. Because of that police report. Because she lied on it excessively. And then after he got out from being arrested, she comes out. Because he was only a bookings for like a couple hours. He comes out. And like days later, she's dead hitting him up talking about some. She got her cousin because she can't hit him up directly. She got like her family members to hit him up like, oh, if you want to see your son, you got to. You got to come to the airport because like she was just moving real, real walky and like disoriented. But whatever, I'm not I'm not I'm not one to, um, you know, I'm not one to go back and forth with people that's not here with me. So eventually I just stopped talking to the boy like 100 percent. Like I just stopped talking to him because it's like that right there. That's it. And I'm not even one to say like, oh, I'm better than this person or whatever. But I'm going to say in this situation, don't fight nobody ugly and don't fight no one you beaten in real life. Those are losers. Do not lower your bar for losers. You know why? Because then you become one. And I'm not in the business of being a loser. So hopefully she got, she's getting the help that she needs or... She got what she was looking for, but I wish her the best and I pray for the safety and betterment of her child.
But anyways, y'all, that's the end of this vlog. Make sure you guys follow me on my social media right here below, and I'll put it in the description. And till next time. Passed on my birthday and his word to my mother, and she just kicked me out the crib, man. We ain't been talking since.